welcome back to my channel so in today's video i will be showing you guys uh what i read in a week there are some weeks that i read a lot there are some that i don't read a lot but that's what this video is about and in today's video i will not be reading like a specific theme let's say like i will not read a book from my favorite authors or especially or like sports romance for a week or i don't know but this week i will be mood reading so i will read whatever i feel like and to be honest right now i'm feeling like rereading a one of my favorite books but i read it on kindle unlimited and i bought the physical copy and i will be rereading it and annotating and that is of sight by Avery Keelan. You've probably seen this in some of my recommendation videos because I love this book so so much. It, it's a thick book, okay? Let me just say um it's around 600 pages with bonus chapter, but yeah. And this is the first book that I will be reading for this week. So, come along with me as a mood reader and to see how much I read in a week. Here is my my annotation stuff oh today's monday by the way it's monday 25th and it's 3 35 p.m So I've been reading for a couple of hours, not that much. So I'm currently on page 74. Obviously for you, I haven't moved from here, but it's actually 6.05 guys it's a couple of hours later i'm on page 140 but i've been tabbing a lot i don't know if you can actually see but i'm thinking at the same time what should i read next i don't know if i should read on my kindle um i haven't read on my kindle in quite some time i'm in the middle of obviously this one that i just started the long game by elena armas um i'm on page 56 my dad got me a ice cream which i'm really happy about guys it's actually the next day i don't remember the last time i updated you guys and i started reading this morning well this morning when i woke up and i am now on page 263 so i'm probably like 45 or 40 percent through the book so it's much later it's like 10 p.m but i've been reading a lot today i have like 130 pages left but yeah i'm like let's say 80 percent of the, through the book around that but yeah we'll continue reading Hey guys so it's the next day but yesterday night i finished my reread of offside by every keelan as you can see i annotated a lot of the book but um yesterday i started this book called ryan rule by cd Kin kincaid I don't know how to say that last name, okay? I'm sorry. But I started this book. I know the cover is hideous, but it's a five book series about four brothers, the Ryan brothers. I'm like 70, 73% 70, through the book. Can you actually see that? Yeah, 73% through the book it's a mafia why choose romance i don't know if it's considered dark romance 
the majority of mafia books are so maybe it is or maybe the other books in the series are darker i feel like this one isn't really but obviously we are seeing her um navigating a relationship with all of the brothers that is what why choose is we will see how it goes because this is only the first book in the series and i think all of the books in the series are about them but yeah um, i started last night and i kept reading as soon as i woke up i didn't want to jump into another sports romance because these four books i'm in the mood for but this is a themed reading vlog this will be the next reading vlog uh this is out on wednesday this will be out on sunday so you should totally check this reading vlog i will continue reading my why choose mafia romance and i will update you guys with what we will continue reading probably today because i only have like 30 percent through the book and like i said it's a really quick read so let's continue reading guys so i just finished the book that i was reading but i just finished the book um i'm about to download the others because it ends on the cliffhanger but let's see the second one how many pages has the second book okay the second book is shorter it's 334 so i will probably be able to read it and finish it today maybe maybe not it depends but yeah i will continue reading this weird but good series so it is friday today and i just finished the second book in the series and like the author said it ends on a cliffhanger and i'm debating if i should read the third book or just like read something else because i've only been reading this series um it's a couple of hours later from the last time that i updated you guys and i was debating which book to start if i should continue the series that i was reading what but i decided to read this arc that i received the referral program by shamara ray um i have no idea what this book it's about i only know that it's a romance let me just check dylan ivy and brooke are successful brilliant confident and beautiful and yet they found themselves in their mid-30s and very single tired of searching for her mr right finding only mr wrong dylan comes up with a plan to solve our little single lady whoa the plan is simple each friend will refer men they already know who will make a perfect partner but just isn't right for them and as you can see in the cover it says just because he's not right for me that's really cool okay so i will start that like i said i got an arc for it through net galley but the book it's already out it's been it's been out for i think a month or so but uh yeah i will read it now um i will be honest i wasn't in the mood to read but just because i didn't know what to read and i found this hello guys so yesterday night i told you guys that i was about to start a first book the referral program by shamara ray so I started this book yesterday. I finished all of it in one sitting. I started like at 9, I think. I'm not sure. I felt asleep when I finished it. It was so good. It was a quick book, quick read. It was like 200 and something pages, I'm pretty sure. But it's about three women. They're in the mid-30s. And obviously they're like, you know, we want to find the perfect men the referral program it's them referring 
men that they know but they don't want to be with and that will be perfect for their friend so they do that and that's how they meet the perfect men so we follow the three of them which was really cool i really really liked it it was really great it was amazing but yeah i read that and today i may start this book Guys, yesterday I didn't read absolutely nothing and today it's the last day of this um reading vlog but yeah um today i started this book rules of the game by jay wilder um i read the first book in that series or interconnected standalones i really liked it i even bought a physical copy of and this is the second book i only started like this afternoon i'm pretty sure i'm 14 percent through and i'm really liking it it's brother's best friend the second she met him she has a crush on him and he does have a crush on her but obviously you know he's best friend with her brother so he doesn't want to uh, cross that line but and it's actually 10 p.m 